Okay guys, I've got a fun video for you today. I've got two acoustic guitars that I'm going to do a comparison of. Now one is uh, this one, this is a Larry Vey C10, and this is the Glary GT502. Now these are both acoustic guitars. Uh, they both have spruce tops, kind of similar design and construction, but the big difference is that this guitar costs $50, and this guitar costs $5,000. Today I want to see just how big of a difference there really is in terms of the playability and the sound. Now just to give you guys a little bit more information about these guitars, like I said, this is a Larry Vey C10, uh, an acoustic electric, and it's got a Sitka spruce top, really beautiful Indian rosewood back and sides, ebony fretboard, we've got an ebony head plate, which is like a layer of wood they put on top of the headstock. Uh, the headstock and the neck is mahogany, and then we've got bone nut and uh, the bone uh, saddle bridge here and an ebony bridge. And of course, you've got some beautiful abalone inlays and binding around the body. In the other corner is the Galeri GT502. This has a laminate spruce top, which basically means it's a very thin spruce plywood. Then there's uh, the uh, basswood sides and back a rosewood fretboard, a maple neck, and plastic nut and bridge down here. And we've got some, some plastic binding on the neck and around the body. Now there's no question that between these two guitars, this Larry Vey is the much better looking of the two, and just the overall construction and craftsmanship is far, far superior to the cheap guitar. But when it comes to the playability and the sound, what's the difference between $50 and $5,000? Now to make this comparison a little bit more even, because the Larry Vey is an acoustic electric with a built-in pickup, I'm going to add on a, an external sound hole pickup to this guitar so I can record it both in terms of the acoustic sound and a direct sound. So that will increase the overall cost of this guitar slightly, but I'm gonna use a really cheap acoustic pickup that only costs about 15 bucks. All right guys, so these are the guitars. Let's check out the comparison. Okay guys, so honestly, what did you think there? 
Now obviously the Larry Vey is a much more beautiful instrument. It has much better fit and finish and overall craftsmanship. And of course you get the bragging rights of owning a $5,000 guitar. Now definitely the more expensive guitar did play and sound better. But $50 to $5,000, that is a huge jump. And as nice as the Larry Vey is, the cheap guitar still played and sounded pretty good. But I think the overall message here is that if you're looking to start playing or maybe you want a second acoustic guitar that you just want to kick around, you really don't have to get something expensive to get something that you can play and sound good on. And this is not meant to take anything away from Larry Vey or any of the other top-end acoustic manufacturers. The quality of those guitars is not in question. It's really just a matter of the fact that the quality of the cheaper guitars has come up a lot in the last few years. All right, so what do you guys think? If you had the money to spend, would you spend it on a really nice expensive guitar or a cheaper one that you can still play but you don't have to worry about it getting damaged? All right, guys, thanks again for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe and stay tuned for more videos. I'll talk to you soon.